Okay, so this is my kitchen cupboard. And it is pretty cluttered. Let me show you the inside. Absolute chaos. It's just absolutely mental. I have everything in there. I've put up these hooks for my kids' bags and their jackets. But at the moment it's shoes and everything in there. And a pantry with jackets. So I'm going to get this all declared for us. I'm just starting by pulling everything out that's on the floor. The ironing board. I never iron so I don't even know why I have that to be quite honest with you. Fold up table. Broom. And a broken box of shoes because my partner fell into the cupboard one night. Don't ask, I don't know how. I'm just starting by pulling everything out that's on the floor. The ironing board. I never iron so I don't even know why I have that to be quite honest with you. Quick sweep up of everything. There was some bits of the plastic of the box that was still on the floor and just giving it a general clean over. food last night so he's only had a pouch this morning before I go to the shop and he is constantly meowing at me all day all day so far and that's him finally going outside Give me some peace and quiet for a little while. So I've just taken this box of hats and scarves out of the cupboard. Giving it a quick go through, see what all we've got. Just checking, putting the matching pairs of gloves together again. It is so cold here at the moment. Ridiculously windy as well, so we really do need to wrap up warm. And of course Jaden, my daughter, has to get involved in everything. So here she is, trying on the hats and scarves that haven't been seen since last winter. She's been sick, so she's off school at the moment. But as you can see, she is a lot better today. I brought this box in to put one set of hats and scarves and gloves in to put this by the front door just to make it a little bit more accessible. I was using this cupboard as a shoe closet as well, but they were just getting messed about. We couldn't find anything, things were just getting chucked in. So you'll see at the end of the video, I have got a box that I have put shoes in at the very front door. And I've put that there and then also got the, the little box there that I was just doing with the hats and gloves and I've put that by the front door.
So now I'm just putting some of the appliances back in. My steam cleaner's been put back in there. The hoover and the dustpan, getting Jaden and put something in the bin there. The hoover just kind of like roamed about different rooms of the house depending on where it was being used. So hopefully now it has a proper home and it's not going to be standing in the way. And there she is, hiding in the cupboard. I put the ironing board, the folding table and one of the brooms out to the sheds because we just don't use them. There's no point in them being in this cupboard here. Arguing with Jaden about her trying to get out of this cupboard. Apparently she's getting old, so it takes her time. She's five. And this is the finished result. Much better than it was. So this is like my pantry side and I've got baskets here. I'll maybe do a separate video on what all is in there once I've actually filled them with food because I need to go food shopping. And there's the school bag and jacket pegs. That is my front door. So this is the wee hat, hat box. The shoe box here. It was. It can be used as a stool and I got it from B&M for £9.99 and it's literally just right by the front door. Apologies for my weird camera angles. <laughs>